so guys, I'm at Lake Powell. You can see this cool scenery. We're out in the water. We have a houseboat. We're here with our cousins. It's really fun. Uh, here in the afternoon, we're kind of settling down a little bit, and we decide we're just going to look for stuff. I actually caught a hognose snake, which will be in another video. And uh, earlier in the day, I caught a few lizards, and one of them is this really cool collared lizard, which I'll pull out of here. First time I ever caught one, and I was super pumped because... Oh no, no. Okay. This one, this guy's strong. I'm just gonna set it down right here. So, these guys are collared lizards because they have black on there, kind of around their neck. And sometimes it will go even further right here. The lighting might be kind of bad. I apologize. It's getting pretty late in the day. So, there's not very much sun left. But I don't really have another opportunity to take this video. But another cool thing about this guy is he has this neon orange head. I saw another one earlier with like a neon yellow head. Most of the ones I've seen has this uh, orange head. And you can see he's, he's decently sized. And on his back, he has yellow and brown spots everywhere. He's really squirmy. And he's pretty strong, but yeah, you can see he's, he's pretty chunky. He's kind of he's thick down there. <laughs> but yeah, so cool orange. You can maybe get a little closer look at his head. Hopefully it'll focus with the not too good lighting. But yeah, you can you can see he's lost the very end of his tail right there before just kind of changes to a different color. It has some pretty decent hands as well. Decently big at least. Uh, but yeah, they can they can climb on anything. So yeah, really cool lizard. Glad I could finally catch one. I'm just gonna flip around so you can hopefully see the whole body at the same time. But yeah, there we go. So I think we're just gonna release him right here and see where he goes. He doesn't have too much energy because the sun's not out as much, but I'll get a few, some good shots of him until he goes. Yeah, so it's a little blurry because of the lighting, but I don't think it should be too bad. So I'm just gonna just kind of let him go into there so he can hide. And we're gonna probably go out tonight and see if we can find and catch anything else.